you have to keep an eye on it. Soak the beef in beer. You can get the same tender and juicy black pepper steak as in a western restaurant. Learned. You must not show off everywhere. Let's first cut the beef tenderloin into thick slices like this. Then hit it with the back of the knife. Convenient and delicious. The key to tender beef. Just put it in beer and soak it for 10 minutes. This can change the texture of beef, thereby softening the meat. After soaking, add onions. One pack of black pepper steak marinade. Many western restaurants are using it. Another spoonful of cooking oil. Use your left hand to grasp and mix thoroughly. Marinate for another 20 minutes. You can do more every time. Put it in the refrigerator. If the child wants to eat it, he can take it out and fry it at any time. Fry until golden brown on both sides. Smart mom. I will definitely not feed my children synthetic steak from outside. Do it yourself cleanly and reassuringly. Beef is an excellent source of protein, helps maintain normal body functions, and repair tissue. Beef is a good source of iron, helps prevent iron deficiency anemia. Beef contains zinc and vitamin B6, can help maintain normal function of the immune system. Protein and amino acids in beef, can help promote muscle growth and repair. For athletes and fitness enthusiasts, is a good food choice. Protein and fat in beef, can help maintain a feeling of fullness, reduce appetite, helps control weight. Pour egg liquid into the pot. A breakfast worth dozens of dollars in a hotel. Make it yourself at home. Just a few dollars. Full of nutrition. Simple method. Break two eggs into a bowl. Stir it up. Boil water in pot. Then turn off the heat. Wait until there are no bubbles in the pot. Gently pour the egg liquid into the pot. The egg drop made this way is very fresh and tender. Do not scatter flowers. I share a simple home-cooked meal every day. Just pay attention to it. If you want to eat but don't know how to cook it, you can still find me. Then cover and simmer for another minute. This is the egg-filled pancake that we always prepare at home. No trans fatty acids. The ingredient list is also very clean. It's safe to feed your children. 20 tablets per bag. Also comes with cake filling sauce and a small brush. Fry directly without defrosting. A big lump will bulge in two minutes. How about it? Is it fun and relaxing? Poke a hole in it. Pour the egg liquid into it. Flip it over twice and it's ready to go. Brush with the complimentary sauce. Add lettuce. Cucumber. Ham sausage. Put whatever you want to eat. Even more delicious than the ones from roadside stalls. Clean and hygienic. Add some shrimp skin. Seaweed and coriander to the egg drop soup. Salt. Sesame oil and light soy sauce. Seaweed soup is ready. Do this for breakfast. Nutritious and delicious. Both children and adults love to eat it. The most important thing is that it only takes a few minutes. If you like it, hurry up and collect it. I never expected it. Cut off the shrimp heads and fry them. A meal in a tea restaurant costs more than 100. You can do it at home for only 10 yuan. After frying the shrimp heads to remove the shrimp oil, be sure to pour in my boiling water. Take out the shrimp heads again and don't throw them away. Add a bowl of pre-washed rice. Turn on low heat and cook for 20 minutes. Let me share with you a little trick. Put a chopstick next to the pot. If you cover it again, it won't leak out. I teach cooking carefully every day. Can you give me a free little red heart to encourage you? Thank you so much. Every time I make seafood porridge, I will make this egg-filled pancake for my family. Its ingredient list is very clean. No trans fatty acids. There are 20 tablets in a bag. There is also complimentary pie filling sauce and a small brush. No need to defrost. Fry directly in the pan. Two or three minutes. A big bag will bulge. Isn't it fun? Let's poke a hole in it. Pour in the egg liquid. Fry the eggs until set. Once the pancake is cooked, it's ready to be taken out of the pan. Brush with the sauce that comes with it. Add lettuce, cucumber, ham sausage. This taste is enough to set up a stall. It's clean and convenient to make at home. By this time, the porridge we cooked was already very sticky. Pour in the shrimp with heads removed. Just the right amount of lettuce. A spoonful of salt to taste. Delicious shrimp and vegetable porridge is ready. This egg-filled pancake. Usually we don't mix it with milk or soy milk or shrimp porridge. Both adults and children love to eat it. If you like, hurry and collect it and make it for your family to try. When stewing pig's feet, be sure not to put the ingredients randomly. Be sure to remember the trick of putting three and not putting two. The stewed pig's feet will be soft and tasty. Melts in your mouth. The soup is as thick and white as milk. Today I'm using a little trick I learned from an old chef. Share with everyone. I bought two pig trotters for 15 yuan. First chop the pig's feet into pieces. Don't be too big. Otherwise, if you have a small mouth, you won't be able to fit it in. Then put the chopped pig's feet into the big plate. Here comes the point. Never blanch pig's feet directly in the pot. Otherwise, the smell of pig's feet will be very strong. First pour a basin of water to cover the pig's feet. Add a lot of salt. 
because after the light salt water slowly penetrates into the pig's feet, can soak out the blood very well. I teach you a little cooking trick every day. Please give me a red heart to encourage you. Thank you so much. After soaking, Blanche, the blood in the pig's feet like this, can be fully released. Pour in a little more high strength liquor, remove fishy smell and increase aroma. After boiling, remove the blood foam, take out the pig's feet and clean them, then boil a pot of water. Add the blanched pig trotters. When stewing pig's trotters, first don't add salt. Salt can speed up the coagulation of collagen. Second, don't release water midway. Third, add fennel, angelica, and hawthorn. It's all in this package. There are more than a dozen spices in it. They are all prepared by the chef according to the proportions. It is a special package for stewing pig, mutton and beef. It is also the key to delicious soup. There are five packets inside. Whether you are stewing pig's trotters, stewing ribs, or stewing beef and mutton, put a small pack at a time. The flavor goes up instantly. Buckle the lid, simmer for an hour, season with appropriate amount of salt. Finally, sprinkle with coriander and wolfberry and it's ready to eat. Pork trotters soup stewed like this. The soup is creamy and rich, delicious. If you like it, collect it and make one for your family. From now on, I will make this oyster sauce lettuce dish when I have guests over at home. Simple method. It also means making money. First add a spoonful of salt to the water. Stir evenly and dissolve. Then put the lettuce in and soak it for 10 minutes. Clean again. At this time we can see, all the dirt and bugs inside have soaked out. Boil water in a pot. Add a spoonful of salt. Get some flavor in advance. Add cooking oil. Vegetables cooked in this way. It won't turn yellow after a month. Blanch lettuce in boiling water for 20 seconds. Take out and serve on a plate. Heat oil in pot. Saute minced garlic until fragrant. Put a little more oyster sauce. When choosing oyster sauce, be sure to read the ingredient list. Like this oyster sauce I used. It's really different from ordinary oyster sauce. A lot of cheap blended oyster sauce. The ingredients are all water and soy sauce. We must see clearly. Where did they rank the oyster juice? This oyster sauce. The first thing on the ingredient list is oyster juice. It is still made using intangible cultural heritage techniques. It tastes fresh rather than salty. Whether you use it for stir-fried vegetables or cold dishes, it's okay. And the design of this toothpaste tube is really convenient. Not like the previous glass bottle. The bottle cap has become stuck after being used for a long time. I can't even shake it out when cooking. Just squeeze as much as you use. Not the last drop will be wasted. The bottle mouth also has a leak-proof method. It's clean after use. You get what you pay for. I really should give my family some good oyster sauce. Add some light soy sauce and stir fry to bring out the aroma of the sauce. Add another bowl of water. A little sugar for freshness. Pour in water starch. Make a thick thin layer. Pour over lettuce and serve. How to make oyster sauce lettuce. Give me a pig and you won't exchange it. The weather is getting cold. When stewing beef, don't put ingredients randomly. We must keep in mind the trick of putting three and two out. The beef stewed in this way will be tender. The more I eat, the more I want to eat. Today I spent 40 to buy 2 kilograms of beef. The weather is getting colder. Beef is getting more expensive. Cut into large pieces. Put the chopped beef into a large basin. Never blanch it directly in the pot. That smell is very strong. You just pour a can of beer. Let it soak for 10 minutes. Because the protease in beer can soften the meat. It can also quickly soak out the blood inside. I share a cooking tip every day. It doesn't matter if you click on the red heart or not. As long as you learn. I'm very happy. Don't throw away the blood soaked in it. Put the pot under cold water. Add high strength white wine to remove fishy smell and enhance aroma. Skim off the foam after the water boils. Take out the beef and wash it with warm water. Pour into the casserole. Fill up the boiling water I added at once. Never put cooking wine. Because cooking beef with cooking wine will ferment it. Can easily cause beef meat to become sour. It's easy to get muddy soup. Second, don't add garlic. If you add garlic, it will smell like raw garlic. Need fennel. Cumin can bring out the aroma of beef crude oil. Put hawthorn. Hawthorn can soften the meat of beef. Add angelica de hurica. Angelica de hurica can remove fishy smell and increase fragrance. Hawthorn and cumin are all put in this bag. It's a master craftsman's calculation of proportions. Made with more than 10 kinds of spices. Whether the beef soup tastes good or not depends on it. There are 5 small bags in this big bag. One small pack can be made once. Be it beef or lamb stew. Just a small pack. Cover and cook for 50 minutes. After 50 minutes add the white radish. Cook for another 10 minutes. Just a little salt and pepper for seasoning. Sprinkle with wolfberry and coriander. The beef soup stewed like this is delicious. The meat is tender but not tooth filling. When the weather gets cold, you can save it and cook it for your family. Heat oil and casserole. Pour the processed mushrooms into the pot. Then turn over. 
sauteed mushrooms. This soup is very fresh, fresher than chicken essence and MSG. Then use kitchen scissors to cut into strips with the soup. After everything is cut, pour boiling water into it. Add two slices of ginger, cover and simmer over low heat. Prepare some dried wakame. Soak hair with warm water. You don't need too much wakame. It only takes a little to brew a lot. After soaking, put it in a casserole. Add chopped tofu. If you have the conditions at home, add a few more shrimps and cook them together. Then add soy sauce, pinch of salt, pepper to taste. Then pour in sesame oil. Sprinkle some green onion. Very fragrant. Wakame is particularly high in calcium, 10 times that of milk. The child at home is growing, so I will often make this soup for him. Friends who like it, hurry up and make it. My bananas, never eat it directly. Teach you a more delicious way. Bananas crispy on the outside and tender on the inside. The children are rushing to eat. Let's peel the banana first. Insert the toothpick again, then cut into small pieces and set aside. Beat two egg yolks into a bowl. Add a bag of small crispy meat powder. This powder is the key to crispiness. Add half a bowl of water. Make it into yogurt. Add a little cooking oil. Use this crispy paste. Both the fried eggplant box and the fried lotus root box are both crispy and delicious. Coat bananas in crispy batter. Fry at 60% oil temperature. Before I knew it, I had updated more than 300 food tutorials. It's really too bad that I haven't got your little heart yet. This video, just give me a free little heart. Thank you very much. Fry for one minute and it will be ready. This fried banana is crispy and crispy, one child at a time. So delicious that I can't stop eating. Bananas are rich in dietary fiber and pectin, help stimulate intestinal peristalsis, promote defecation, relieve constipation. Bananas contain a lot of carbohydrates and sugar, able to provide energy quickly, meet the body's energy needs. Bananas are rich in many vitamins and minerals. Vitamin C, vitamin B6 and potassium, etc. helps enhance human immunity, improve body resistance. Bananas are rich in potassium, helps lower blood pressure, prevent cardiovascular disease. Tryptophan and vitamin B6 in bananas can promote the production of serotonin in the brain, helps relieve anxiety and depression, improve mood. The pectin in bananas can protect the gastric mucosa, reduce gastric acid irritation to the stomach wall, relieve stomach pain. Bananas are rich in vitamin A and potassium, helps maintain eye health, prevent myopia. The magnesium in bananas promotes relaxation, helps improve sleep quality. All in all, eating bananas is a very healthy choice, can provide various benefits to the human body. It is recommended to eat bananas in moderation every day.